Welcome to Inside Design with Kandrak and Cole, hosted by two nationally published Atlanta interior designers, Joanne Kandrak and Kelly Cole. These energetic women are also world travelers, charity givers, and bloggers with a wealth of information to share and stories to tell about the interior design world. Okay, now just a warning, this is going to be fun and not too serious. After all, they still do have an interior design business running at full speed. Hey there, welcome to Inside Design with Kandrak and Cole. This is episode 106, and today we're talking about our favorite catalog and online products. So many of you know we've been in business for almost 16 years, and we have been so fortunate that we've acquired so many wholesale furniture accounts, as well as having a wonderful arsenal of talented artisans that we purchase for both our residential and commercial projects. There are times, though, that we turn to online sources or catalogs for certain items, and they would be if our wholesale sources might be out of stock, a client maybe has specifically requested something, or the products are very unique and not available through our sources. So we're going to share our favorites with you. You might want to take some notes or go to our show notes to look at some of these because we're going to get kind of detailed. We want to let you know that this episode is sponsored by Wexel Art. Wexel Art started the concept of a floating acrylic panel that works with pairs of magnets to hold your art in place, allowing you to seamlessly change out what is in the frame in seconds. So you may have seen this kind of out and about, but Wexel I really feel like they started the whole the whole thing. So it's a great way to showcase your children's art which is how we started using mm-hmm. Wexel, without the hassle of custom framing. The word Wexel means change in German, and the line was created to allow you to change your art as often as you like. So they have expanded from a tiny six skew frame company to the leader in Lucite framing. They design and manufacture picture frames, shadow boxes, and their newest initiative, Framed Wall Art. Oh, so great. Which is a curation of independent artists across the country that are framed in Wexel. So... Guys, please check out a past blog post that we did on them called Brilliant Women in Business featuring the two female owners, Morgan Doherty and Natasha McRae. We will put the link in the notes for that blog post, but go visit them, wexelart.com. Yeah. So once again, going back to a previous podcast, episode 41, we talked about one of the services that we offer is called Design for a Day. And at the time, we had realized that we were turning away legitimate qualified clients because they didn't fit into our our model for like an ideal client needing full service. So it's basically a four-hour concierge service. Uh, We come to your home and make selections for you, basically sitting at your kitchen or dining room table with your Wi-Fi, and we create a floor plan, a keynote document showing all the selections, and then a shopping list with links to the retail sources. So this is how we've gotten very much in tune with the retail online sources that are as close as we can come to what we would choose for our full service clients. So we, we, we talked about this in one of our previous podcasts and, and I remember our Lexington rep came in and he was like, what are you doing talking about Ballard Designs? And we're like, listen, you know, in our industry, we got to have a little combo of, of both sometimes. And we don't always do full service luxury design. Sometimes our clients, especially our design for our day clients, you know, they're going to go order it all themselves. We're helping both sides of the industry. Mm-hmm. And, you know, they, everybody has their place. Yeah. And as, as and we'll go ahead and talk about these yeah. bar and counter stools from Ballard's. But Nobody else has them. They're they're a very unique look. Mm-hmm. I mean, some of these companies that we're going to talk about have something that you couldn't really get anywhere else. Mm-hmm. And they work really well and their price point is good. So, yeah, that's what we're just going to kind of help you guys. If you, uh, you know, are missing a few things here and there or you're not familiar with these catalog items, these have been the tried and true we've ordered before. Uh, and they, they are just, they're great products. So yeah. we're going to share that with you. Yeah. So let's start with Pottery Barn. So we usually do all custom bedding. How many times have we ordered this particular? Oh, oh, but now this one, this one that we're telling you about is the Belgian Flax Linen Diamond Quilt and Shams. You know, these companies should be sponsoring this podcast, but (laughs) Wexel, you got, you got to be the sponsor for this one. And this quilt, I am telling you, it is, it's luxurious. Every time you wash it. It's washable. It's soft. It comes in some beautiful colors. B flex linen would be would even yeah. might even like it, you yeah. know, our guest the other day. So yes, so check that one out. And I love the colors. Yeah, comes in a variety of colors, and it's a good size. Yeah, and you they've know. been available. 
They've yes, been available. They, have they been ship. Available. You know, we ordered on a Friday. It was here Tuesday. So the other thing I like about this line is they have euros and king shams or the shams. Mm-hmm. A lot of when I go to find ready-made stuff, they don't always have euros or the big shams. It's yeah. one or the other. If you want to layer, it, layer exactly. Your bed. That's annoying. Uh, yeah. So that is a great one. And then Pottery Barn. In terms of art, they have a lot of different art, but I think their photography mm-hmm. is worth mentioning. There's some really great pieces, and I love there's generally three or four sizes. Mm-hmm. So yeah, that's, it'll work. And that's unique. That is unique. Mm-hmm. Uh, but there's one that we've done a few times, and yes. it's really pretty. Check this one out. It's called Water Hands, and it's a framed print. It's by Michael Venera. It's just this beautiful black and white photograph of a woman's hands with the water coming down. We've done it in bathrooms. She's kind of in like prayer hands, and it's just, it's, it's very. Yeah. Very spiritual. Mm-hmm. It's beautiful. Um, yeah, I just love. Yeah, I love that piece. But we've used their their black and white for or their photography in general, and a lot of the models that we do for multifamily. Mm-hmm. And yeah. I've been impressed. Yeah, especially some- with the size, and they come framed. Yeah, yeah. So, speaking of frames, Pottery Barn, you can't go wrong with their wood gallery frame sets. I can't tell you how many galleries we've used where we've used all pottery barn or we've mixed and matched we've we've used that kind of as our base well they come in like sets you can get like mm-hmm. a set of six or a set of ten and then some of them will be horizontal that have room for like three four by sixes so and then they have the eight by tens and the five by seven so you can really mix them turn them and the wonderful thing is it comes with these templates so the the size of the frame is already it's given to you it's like a pattern and you can kind of tape those up with blue tape on your walls and decide where you want them and then you just hang them yeah. i mean come on they ha- and i uh, in the box they give you gallery idea patterns yes. you know so if you're completely clueless yeah they, they basically well then do there's, it all for you there's black there's white there's a really pretty kind of uh oak sort of color mm-hmm. so there's a few different finishes it, it's it's, it's the a other no-brainer. thing i'll say is those frames are very thin and not in a bit, and I'm saying this in a good way. Mm-hmm. Sometimes when you're doing a gallery, especially when we're doing more contemporary, you know, modern ones, we don't want the frames the to be chunky. too chunky and heavy. And I like how yeah. streamlined they are. Yeah. yeah. Um, they have a bench called the Berlin Tufted Bench. This is just one of those, uh, same thing, mid mid stained wood tufted top and linen the length is perfect for in front of a bed we've used it over and over again just to go, it could work in a, a foyer it's just one of those just basic good old benches that's a lot of times we struggle when we want to do a bench in front of a especially a king bed so king beds are normally about 80 inches wide queen beds are 60 okay so when you take and and you when you go to look at benches they're 36 mm-hmm. 40 I think this one's 55 40 or, yeah. you know 42 and you put that in front of a king size bed and it's it's just it's just not big enough yeah so we're always looking for that kind of 50 plus width in front of a king bed mm-hmm. and then rugs pottery barn has a ton yeah, of know, rugs they really do they're, I, all, yeah, they're a, all really good but we yeah. just we just did a design for a day last week and found this it's called the nicolette hand knotted wool rug it's it's so well made the colors are so pretty the little tiny tufting and it's just it's just beautiful just one to check out it's you know mm-hmm. kind of transitional mm-hmm. uh but they've got a great variety of, of rugs and i will say in in unfortunately in most of these you know what we have found in a lot of the online accounts is damages are part of the game it's very unfortunate sometimes they're from the shipping company sometimes it's just how they got dropped at your door because you maybe you didn't order white glove service but the ones that we're telling you about generally in our experience have come undamaged so there's Mm -hmm. there's some items that we've ordered several times that it's like we're not ordering this again because for some reason the way they package it it's just not good enough so let's not forget in kitchen and dining and this is actually pottery barn and williams sonoma is the marlo thomas entertaining collection it's been sold out i mean someone got it It, for me for a gift and said you'll get it in july yeah but it's so but it came back it came back like they keep restocking so i haven't gotten mine you haven't gotten yours Mm -hmm. yet i think i think that uh, maybe um, it's just that that one tray Mm -hmm. that yeah it's pretty special yeah Mm -hmm. so she was as you all know, we've screamed about it from the rooftops, but Marlo was on our 100th episode and she 
she's an iconic a- actress. If you you're going, who's Marlo Thomas, and why are you making such a big deal about it? And we love her and her entertaining collection. It's all silver and and wood mixed pieces, and they're very unique. They jump out from the website. They're beautiful. Uh, Pottery Barn has an entire home office collection. So many different types of desks. So much different storage credenzas. Sure, I mean. It's worth definitely taking a look at. I know, you know, desks have been really on the hunt lately and a lot of things are backward and whatever, but I feel like they have a great mix. Uh, whether you want to do just a desk or if you want to kind of have matching pieces, they have a great, great um, selection. So I'd And I, I appreciate that. that selection because I feel like when you go online, especially in this era of COVID and you're looking for a desk to stick in a corner because you're working at home now, so many of the desks are so skinny. So the depth, you mean the depth. So if you've got two monitors and a pad of paper or a file that you're working on and you're working on 22 inches or 24 inches of depth, you have no you're, you're going to hate it. You're going to hate it. So, you know, I'm always looking for at least 30 inches in, in depth on a on a mm-hmm. dex and they have a lot of options. So, yeah. Pottery Barn, their outdoor, huge selection of outdoor stuff. Uh, There's a new collection. We haven't bought it, but Mm -hmm. I want to. Mm -hmm. It's called the Behringer, B-E-R-E-N-G-A-R. And it's this all weather. I mean, you can be out in the weather. It's open cane weaving. So it's black with the weave. Very similar to something we just ordered from Mm -hmm. another major wholesaler. Yeah, Yeah, it's really, really beautiful. um, I love that woven outdoor stuff. I do too. So yeah, cool looking. It's really good. And then they have a huge variety of uh, outdoor ceiling fans too. So You know what? I never looked at their outdoor ceiling fans. Yeah, they've got some good ones. In Pottery Barn. There you go. You know, and, and it's like, ugh, Pottery Barn. It's like you almost hate to give them but, props. But you know what? I got to say, you know. There's certain things. I mean, they, yeah, they, you know, they got it going on in some ways. Yeah. yeah a so lot of we, ways, actually. You know, we, picked, we picked our favorites yeah. that, that we have experience with. So, And then the next one. I mean, I, I, I love Ballard Designs. Yeah. Yep. That we are lucky enough to have a store, their flagship store here in Atlanta. But their catalog, I mean, they've been around for a long time. Mm-hmm. Tried and true stuff. So, in terms of furniture, there's so many. There's three coffee tables that mm-hmm. we love. The first is the Andrews coffee table. It's solid mango wood. I love mango wood. I I just mm-hmm. love that it's. Mm-hmm. It's kind of contemporary. It's always got that smooth matte finish like we were talking about with yep. Stacy on the other podcast about, yep. about walnut wood. But um, and it has the, you know, the, the open it's open. So it has the two levels and I love a second level. So you can throw a basket under there, extra magazines, just more storage. Yeah. Then the next one is this. It's the Bornova coffee table. It's a smaller one. It's 36 inches round. It comes in three finishes also, but it's the whole outside around of it is all carved. It's so cute. It's really cute. It's got a ton of personality mm-hmm. and, and the price is really good on that one too. Yep. 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 And then the Cavala coffee table is curved bent ash wood. It's 44 inches round. It's just another it's, one of those tables. So you're like, it, the, that is so freaking cool. Yeah. The, the lines of it, it's so, so pretty. Now, again, 36 inches round, 44 inches round are on the small side, but I will say... No, 44 is 44 not. is not bad. So, sorry. But 36 is. But I'll tell you when we use that one the most, is if we have a sofa with a chase at one end, okay? And so, all of a sudden, your sofa just became a whole lot smaller because of that chase being in the way. And then you can afford, or a sectional of some kind, right. then you can afford that smaller coffee table and it makes sense. Yeah, that's a perfect mm-hmm. solution for that. All right, so we'll go back to the bar and counter stools from Ballard's. I yeah. think they probably have, out of any re, you know any retail or online, they really have the prettiest ones. Uh, the Marguerite stool, is that the one you have, Cal? Yes, I yep. have them at both my houses. Yep, yep. They're, they're like a sw- they're swivel. They have a rush seat, a wood and metal back. I mean, they're just really, really pretty and very durable. Yep. Then the Travisa. So this has a gun metal base. It's like has a saddle shaped wood seat and it it wraps around. There's a wrap around and woven rattan. So it's super cool looking. We've ordered it two or three times. And but I love that that saddle shape. You know what I mean? Where like it's it's kind of a wide seat for a big butt. And it's kind of got that like in the shape of your butt, like Mm -hmm. a like a saddle. 
Yep. Yeah. It's really, really and cool. And then this is really one of the best looking oh, ones. Oh, I, I love this one. I think it, it's it's called the Blakely, and it's got a black woven back, and then a beautiful gray stain finish on the legs. So kind of, could work in a lot of difference. It's not super contemporary, but it's not really traditional, but looks just so great with all of the, you know, the black and white that's out there, and just... Mm, not farmhousey, but it's just a good, I good one. I think it's one. kind of unexpected. Yeah. I love the black mixed in. Yeah. And then for media consoles, we're always on the hunt for media consoles that are very wide or not, you know, just not more than, say, 48 wide and high or, mm-hmm. you know, at least 30, 32, 36 inches high. Some of them are, are well, it depends. If you want it to be really contemporary, you've got a mid-century house, it's all West Elm kind of thing, then the low ones are really good. But I think, I don't know, I just yeah. feel like they kind of get lost in a room sometimes. Yeah. So look up the Delano glass door console. It's ivory base. It's got black doors. It's it's kind of got a farmhouse style yeah, to I it. Ha- I have this one. It, it's, yeah, I, I love it. it. I, I love I've, it. I've loved it for years. Yeah. And I think yeah. you can you can take it in any direction you want. And then Ballard's bookcases, they have so many beautiful ones, but this Salerno glass door cabinet, it has kind of the double casement doors with the pretty handles. It's 85 inches high. That's and key. Then, yep. And it has that cream finish with those oak door panels. Very, very nice looking. Definitely a focal point in, mm-hmm. a, in a room. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And then art. You know, this is another one, kind of like unexpected. They have a lot of exclusive artists and ones that where we have purchased their original art from these artists. So we know them all personally and very well. So they uh, are selling to Ballard's, which, I mean, well, they're prints, take advantage. And, yeah. and it's, it's a nice way to have a, a beautiful piece. You Maybe you just can't afford the original, mm-hmm. but, um, and they, they picked, they curated a great group of artists. Yes. So these are some of our favorites. Andrea Costa, she's actually a, a here in Atlanta. She does these beautiful, beautiful serene landscapes. Mm. Caroline Killebrew, Mm. She does these boats. She does animals, dogs, uh, cows. I mean, so her her art is absolutely beautiful. Mm-hmm. Amy Sullivan. We recently did um, an original, and then we've done the barns in some of our design for days. She does these beautiful barns. I'm she's, in love. She's talented in very many ways. Mm-hmm. And then Laura Lloyd Fontaine does some beautiful landscape marches. Very marshes, sort of Charleston looking. Yes, pretty serene colors. They're all really beautiful. Same thing with them. The sizes you can get different sizes. Yeah, I mean, I I just those are three um, four amazing women, and I can't believe that that you can get their stuff at Ballard. So. So good. And then like Pottery Barn, they also have some really good rugs, whether they natural fiber, indoor, outdoor, door, doormats. Uh, I've been I've been impressed with their collection. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. And then they do have some beautiful mirrors. There's this one. Uh, we've ordered something similar to it. It's the Atoll, A-T-O-L-L, rectangular mirror. It comes in black and white, but it's got this ruffled edge that is... I mean, you, you got to look these up. They're just beautiful. And then the Thomas Round Mirror, you can get it in bronze or gold. It comes in 33 inches or 45 inches. I, I love that 45 inch size. That's mm-hmm. a statement mm-hmm. and a half. Mm-hmm. I mean, perfect over a console. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's yep. that's a goodie. And then another favorite is called the Lindy, L I N D Y mirror. It's round. It's It comes in either 34 or 44. Mm-hmm. It's got like these round spools and this beautiful gray wash finish. I absolutely am obsessed with that mirror. Me too. We've used it. I, you know, and we don't repeat much from, you know, but but from time to time. Really but that good. one is, that's yeah. probably one of my all-time favorite mirrors of all of our sources. It's yeah. the Lindy. Got to look it up. All right. So, I am totally obsessed with Etsy. Literally, I I think, I, I, I mean, when it comes to my lake house, like I need something. I'm like, I need a custom rug. Etsy. I need a custom coat rack. Etsy. You, you, if you're not familiar with Etsy, E-T-S-Y dot com, it's all artisans. They're out there. They're making their stuff. It's all, it, and it's the, shipping. The thing quickly. that I, yeah, we, we're going to give you three, but there's so many. Yes. But the thing that I love about them, I have to say every time I've had an experience, whenever I've gotten the package, it's come packaged beautifully. Mm-hmm. A handwritten thank you note. Yes. And it's like you want to go back and give them a review because a lot of times you can look at the reviews and very rarely do I see anything that says, oh, no, don't order. It's usually like they, the you know, the, the shipping was 
Um, excellent. The um, mm-hmm. the sellers answered my questions right away. It's always been a really nice experience. It's funny order. that you say that because I literally got home from the lake late last night and I had a box from Etsy on my doorstep and I ordered these. I was going to do... St- a f- really funky tile going up my stair yeah. runners, right? Or stair, uh, the tr- the back of the, uh, I'm being a dork, the tread, the, not the treads, the risers. Hello, the yeah. risers. And I was playing around on Etsy looking for something else. And hello, they make them in s- vinyl stickers that look exactly like tile. So my stairs are different widths and different the risers are different heights. She totally custom made this whole thing for me. It came in this adorable box and it was, she had taken all this like fun, colorful newspaper and shredded it. And so it was all fi- it, just like you're saying. They, it they was do extra. So they well. do a little extra. Yeah. Well, what's her name? Cause I don't have her on this list. Um, I think it was, I'll look it up while we're chatting. I think it's Dizzy Decal or something like that. If you if you go into Etsy and you say stair, tra- stair riser decal, she comes up like right away. I'm just yeah. so impressed. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Turkish rugs. You're oh my sharing God. my favorite I, I source. Know. I don't want people to know about Why? her. <laughs> yeah, we have to, this is, this is, <laughs> All right, here She's it is. She's my I'm secret. Ta- Antica Art, A N T I K A. Beautiful, you know, vintage Moroccan. Uh, oh, my gosh. Where is she located? She ships from Turkey, maybe. Um, and literally. She ships DHL, and I want to say it comes in less than a week when you order a rug. It's amazing. In this tiny package, yeah. you're like, my rug is yeah. not in that package. And, and yes, don't, it is. And don't be um, afraid if you see that the person is in the UK or wherever, because the stuff comes fast. Yeah. Yeah. They're used to it. So we just found mm. this Etsy artist. Actually, our client found yeah. them. Or did we find I them? I found them. Okay, girl. Um, take okay, credit girl. for this one, honey. So a lot of times when we have a... Two things, either a wall that has switches or thermostats in very annoying locations where we have we need art that kind of will climb and wander and move or you have a bed that maybe the bed has a very has a shape. The headboard has a shape or you've already got a lot of art in the bedroom and you just need something else, something decor ish. And you're like, I can't do a mirror. I don't want to do a clock. What do I do? This artist it's called map studio artworks but you spell it m-a-a-p studio artworks and she does ceramic and porcelain wall art so what we did for this client that this was in her bedroom she's got a navy and white theme going on in her bedroom and these plates they all they all have like a hand poured is she where is she, is she in italy where is this girl i don't know is where she, she in the is. States? i don't know where she is the edges of these they're like bowls or like round they're imperfect sort of but they're all yeah. very they're very wavy and but they have a gold finish on oh my god yeah, hard to explain you yeah, really just, just need to go look it up you just need to look it up believable yeah it's it's when you can have a great find like that so here unbelievable sharing jute scalloped rugs these are so fun you can get them you know right your regular jute which is kind of the gold color that are scalloped but then they can be framed out in any any color so cute for you know an entryway or um, a runner in front of a kitchen sink uh, the company is called Himalayan Rugs Co on Etsy Check I just ordered one out. from my laundry room he can do custom sizes so I did a three foot by four foot uh, jute with a black border I mean, I'm so excited about it. A three by four. I'm never going to find that anywhere. How quick will you get that? Oh, I just messaged him. I said, can you make me a custom size of three by four? Of course. It was one fifty nine, and uh, it's just shipped. Yeah. Who's, who's out there making those things I know, so quick? Exactly. So great. Crazy. crazy. So, Joanne, we're going to have to do part two of this. Are this we getting so close? Exciting. To, oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Look some, at how much oh more we God, have to we go. Got, well, all, all right. right we're well, doing well, part two. Quit, quit chatting. Okay, okay. So, Crate and Barrel. I have to say, Crate and Barrel's got some really beautiful furniture. It might not be... You know, the budget furniture, some of the pieces are a little more expensive, but they're beautiful. And we have done this a couple of times. It's an it's a console. It's the 84-inch Silviano iron console. The the iron legs, the way that this is made, it's it just makes a statement in a room. It's 
pretty thin. It's great in a entryway, family room. It's yeah, it's just, really good. Yeah, it's, it's really, really good. good. Yeah. And then remember, I was talking about benches that you know it's so hard to find the wide ones. Well, they have one. It's a whitewashed bench. It's actually seventy two wide. It's skinny, fourteen and a half deep, and eighteen high. So you could use this as a coffee table in front of a really large sofa where you just need something narrow, say it's getting tight, in a foyer where not a lot of room, but you want to dump stuff. Mm -hmm. Or, of course, at the end of a king-size bed. A little too big for the end of a queen, but perfect for a king. Yeah, it worked great as a, as a coffee table for that one job that we did. It was a kid's playroom. Yes. And we we wanted to give them some extra space, you know, for the kids to play with stuff, but you definitely needed a place to put drinks and stuff. And it was just, the it was like, almost the length of the sofa mm-hmm. so everybody you could put your feet up yeah mm-hmm. it's really really a good one and then we recently discovered this at a design for a day it's the notch swivel chair it's kind of a small scale but it's very clean line it had a very durable plush chenille fabric on it and so and they were in stock available and it was is that the one we did for, for Stoltz's Lindsay. Playroom? Lindsay. Playroom? Oh, for Lindsay. Yeah. yeah, the one just last week. Yeah, that's right. And uh, we were we were so surprised. We, we needed that small scale. Yep. So I really, I really love the look of that one. Um, okay, we have so much more to share. Let's do part two next okay. week. Okay. Okay. Is that good? Yeah, that's good. Um, so we really like we were saying in the beginning we really curate this stuff we we've we've searched and searched and searched and without all props to our manufacturers and our and our luxury companies that we work with they are truly amazing but th- this is just a different ball game this yeah. is this is a different kind of when you need something quick or you're just not going to hire a, f- a designer yeah. you know to do the whole kit and caboodle one or, for one you. or two one or two one things or two. yeah i mean i'll say i'm a big proponent of you get what you pay for and i a lot of times these companies are actually cheap <laughs> they're really expensive mm-hmm. you know yeah i mean we buy the the upholstery that we buy actually for our full service clients i think is oh much less much less cost less and is way better quality than you're ever going to find online but sometimes you know it's you don't need that or i think what we have the most luck with retail wise is more case goods and art, mm-hmm. uh, rugs, accessories. We don't lean too heavily on the online sources for upholstery because we feel very strongly that we need to know exactly how it was manufactured, how it was made, what the cushions are made of. Yeah. And, we, and we've sat in. We've sat in them personally at High Point Furniture Market. So we don't really, you know, go there yeah. on the online sources. Yeah. Oh, we are almost out of time. Yeah, I'm telling you, girl. Okay, so I'm so glad we've got more to share with you next time. Yes. All right, so our quotes. Okay, I want to do the funny one because I feel like I'm always clicking this. Okay. Okay, here it is. How many times do you have to click I accept cookies before they send you the cookies? And you know, my husband's always saying, "Don't accept the cookies because it's and you know spam." Well, then how are you supposed to get? I know. How are you supposed to get to the website? How are you supposed like, to look at the website? Do you understand how many websites I work on in a day for my know. job? I don't even know what these cookies are. What are I, they? I don't know. Just accept them and hopefully they'll you know. be on your doorstep. Yeah. So here's a serious quote to end for today: There are four types of wealth: one, financial wealth, money; two, social wealth as in status, three, time wealth, freedom, physical wealth, health. Be wary of jobs that lure you in with one and two, but rob you of three and four. Very true. So true. I think everybody gets that message after COVID, right? We're all kind of sitting back and going, where where is my life going? What is my life? And what's important? What's important? Absolutely. So, okay, you guys, we hope you took notes. Again, this will all be in the show notes. So if you go to our website, candrac-cole.com, you can click on the podcast link. You will see every show note to every podcast with all the deets that we talk about. And yeah, if, you might want it for this one because we gave so many yeah, details. So we if did. you forget, what was that bar stool? Like, that was the name of that bar stool. Mm-hmm. You can go right to it and it'll take you right to it. And you'll also see a link to our sponsors for everyone. So if you want to learn more about Wexel, you'll see that on the show notes. And we also want to remind you that if you love listening to us, we would love for you to go online, give us a five star 
rating and give us a review. Yep. And Wexel, you know, we didn't mention this. We have in our conference room, we have framed how many we've got 12, oh, 12 no, or so. I, th- I think we have 18 at least uh, projects that we've done some of our favorite projects and they are in those Wexel frames because it really just makes the the photograph stand out. There's not a lot of frames and it's mm-hmm. all very clear and clean and it looks really, really good. Very cool. Um, yeah. And yeah. then one more shout out to B Flex Linen. So for my husband's birthday, I got him the 100% linen robe for his birthday. And he's a little bit wider in the shoulders. So I had to have her do something custom, which she did so quickly. He has it. He absolutely oh loves my gosh it. i don't know if i could get mike to wear a robe but well, but he is chris ro- our installer yeah. said he wants one he's a ro- i mean my husband is a robe guy he loves yeah. the hot tub yeah you know, and so and it looks so good on him excellent I mean, it's, yeah it's really nice go so, katarina be flax yeah i'm very, very oh the pa- the thing too is like if you're looking for father's day the packaging mm-hmm. you know done so well folded so perfectly beautiful paper with a beautiful sticker yeah so Go be flex. All right. All right, everybody. Thanks for listening. Thanks, everybody. Bye. Bye. Join Joanne and Kelly weekly for a lively conversation about trends, travels to industry events, current design projects, the good, the bad, and the ugly, do's and don'ts, product recommendations, and more. Be sure to follow the fun on Facebook. They're on Instagram, at Kandrak Cole. And of course, you've got to visit them online at kandrak-cole.com for more information.